Hello guys, welcome to my channel Nitkash on WebTech Zone. In this video tutorial, we are going to learn how to import or back and backup the PSD file in Outlook. Okay, so guys, let's start with the video. Before we starting, I request you if you like this video, hit the like button, subscribe my channel, and don't forget comments below. So guys, let's start with the video. So I am here. I am on my Outlook app. So, so first, I am going to show you how you can uh, export your PSD file or backup from Outlook to your hard drive or your computer so just go to the file and go to the open and export option here and then go to the import export so in this process if you want to export your file just click on export to files click outlook data file which is PhD file now select the folder or mail mail uh, which you want to export so uh, you can see I have two mailbox here first is this email second is this email so you have to uh, if you have one, more than one email here so just you have to select one by one so I just select this one so it will be export everything in this email so you can also include subfolder now just click on next now uh, you can replace the duplicate with the item exported or allow the duplicate items exported okay if you have existing file in this folder you can just replace or allow duplicate files I just allow duplicate files and just finish so the yeah the export has been done if you want to check I, I have to go in documents this computer and in documents you can see let me check okay in documents you can see this file has been created if you go to outlook okay so this file has been created okay the same time 544 that's this item so this is backup if you want to restore or you if you want to import the PhD file the same process you have to follow go to the file go again open and export go to the import export so for this time if you want to import just click on import from the files just click on next click on PhD format here you have to find out the backup if it will be automatically find out if this, this is in outlook files and now just do not import duplicate files or you can just click the option what we want I just click on next okay I have to browse the file the file is here select and click next then this is my outlook file so you can include the subfolder here you can import item into the same folder input item into the current folder okay so you can select the folder to where you want to import so I have two email ID here mailbox you can say so you have to select the mailbox where you want to import and just click on finish it will be import okay so guys I hope you like this video please subscribe me thank you for watching